I've already had a good share of strawberries. They are so good here. Uh, also oh, yeah. the season for some of this warm weather, KJ. That's welcome for me too. Oh yes, we're looking forward to temperatures really staying uh, near normal, Jane, for okay. the week ahead. But really I wanna focus on right now is the dry weather because it will be ongoing. So far this month, we've had seven wet days. That means measurable rainfall for seven days, totally a little more than a half inch. So we've had a lot of dry weather and we're at a deficit for the month of May by more than an inch and a half. And this will likely continue, simply put, Little to no chances of rain for the better part of this week. You can see goose eggs right there from Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Little to no chances of rainfall. Even by the end of the week, those rain chances are bleak. I know many of you favor the low rain chances, especially when the inclement weather can interfere with those outdoor plans. And going forward towards the end of the month, we're really not leaning towards above average or below average when it comes to rainfall. So we're sort of in a neutral zone when it comes to on which side we'll lean when it comes to the rainfall. Meanwhile, let's take a look at what's happening out there right now. No chances of rain in the forecast for tonight. Unlike yesterday, we've had a few showers pushing through around this time, but that's not the case for today. You can carry on with those outdoor plans. As you can see the quad view right now, courtesy of Mr. Sparky across the area, we do have some cloud cover out there. By and large, not expecting rainfall, much drier weather for today. Behind that cold front, we now have high pressure in place and that is going to suppress those rain chances going forward. Meanwhile, temperatures upper 70s now, close to 80 for most areas as we approach sunset within the next two hours. Temperatures Monroe, you're coming in at 77. Lancaster, same for you. Chester, we can see these temperatures, nice fitting conditions for those outside plans, and it's not as muggy today as it was before that storm system pushed through in terms of that cold front. Overnight lows will stay in the mid 50s for most of you. Gastonia through Charlotte, Rock Hill, mid 50s out the door tomorrow morning. Boone, you'll be a little bit cooler in the mid 40s. Lenore coming in in the mid 50s and the same for Monroe. Check this out. This is your forecast for tomorrow. Kicking off the work week, it is going to be dry. However, even though it's going to be dry, do not be deceived or fooled by the cloudy skies. We will carry on with more clouds and sunshine to kick off the week. You can see the cloudy icons right there despite the cloud cover. Notice how we're going to warm up tomorrow. We'll have temperatures coming in around 80 for highs on your Monday afternoon. For Monday morning, you can see mostly sunny skies for the start of the day, but these clouds will fill in the gaps throughout the afternoon. And the same story for your Tuesday. We'll have more clouds and sunshine into the day. Not totally going to be overcast, but we'll look at predominantly cloudy skies through the first part of the week. More sunshine into your Wednesday and Thursday by Friday. Those are those small rain chances, as you see it here on the guy roof and seven day forecast. And notice these temperatures consistently in the mid to upper 70s for afternoon highs. Even your morning lows will trend in the upper 50s to around 60. Jane.